on everybody, my name is Corey and welcome to another episode of NerdWorks Top 5. And before you guys all get to speculation, let's go over something right away. I have shaved. Yes. The beard is gone for now. For now. Uh, the reason is because today, today we're gonna go over my top 5 favorite superhero games. Games games. Now, I don't necessarily have superpowers. As a kid, I tried a lot, probably an unhealthy amount, to get spiders to bite me. Because I wanted to be Spider-Man. <laughs> We're gonna have a spider bite you. You're gonna be in like a coma for a year, but when you wake up, you'll have Spider-Man's powers. I would seriously consider it. Spider-Man me up. Let's go! Okay, so, uh, moving on really quick before we get started, I would like to show off my one superpower, because I have one of them. And it is to make my beard grow back. So, okay. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Think real hard. Beard. Beard. <sighs> beard. <laughs> How did I get this shirt on? This is different. This is brown coats. <gasps> That's a Firefly reference. Let's, let's get back. Let's get back to the old shirt here. So now that that's taken care of, now that that's out of the way, and my credibility is intact, don't ask questions. Just don't. Don't be that guy. Come on. Come on. Just kind of bear with me while I sip some water here. So. <clears throat> oh. I am just finding superpowers all over the place. Okay, so maybe it's more than five, but I figure what I would do is I put two of them that are similar together, uh, and that's what I did here, because this is the Marvel Heroes, and then there's Ultimate Alliance, and they're kind of like the same thing. You, like, do this kind of Diablo-style, top-down, beat them up uh, with crazy amounts of loot and different things. This one's a PC exclusive, while Marvel Ultimate Alliance is for consoles. Uh, but you can, in this, it's pretty, it's, a, it's Diablo. It's Marvel Diablo. Uh, and then here you see we got Marvel Ultimate Alliance. This one, it's four people, four heroes at the same time. You can switch between them on the fly. Beating up people, always got to represent Spider-Man. Webbing people, look at that. You're shooting them with a laser beam. It's a fun game. You can spec your heroes out how you want to. Really kind of tailor them to your liking. It's an awesome couple of games. Heroes! So you see, this is me ripping off what I just did on another one. So these ones are the, the MMOs in the game. So these are the massively multiplayer online ones. Champions is f***ing awesome. It's so much fun. You can spec your character in these crazy ways. Like, you can make whatever you want, and it's wicked, wicked cool. Uh, Champions, I never really played when it first came out. It's really old, and it's free to play right now. So go play it if you like MMOs and superheroes. And then we got DC Universe Online. Which is the same thing, only it's got DC characters rather than ones you make up on your own. I mean, you do make your own superhero, but they work with, like, Superman and Batman and Wonder Woman, uh, or the Joker if you want to make a villain, but honestly, who would do that? You'd have to be a d to do that. Actually, I think this guy's a villain. Eh. <laughs> Whoops. But, uh, it's fun. It's really cool. It really makes you feel like a superhero, and I think that's what superhero games should be about, is making you a superhero. <laughs> Okay, before we go any further, I just want you to know that I know that I suck at fighting games, so you can shut your goddamn mouth. I know I suck. <laughs> this is Justice Gods Among Us! This is a fighting game with DC characters. Uh, it's cool because you get to beat every. You can finally get that. Who would win, Superman or Batman? Let me tell you, it's Batman or Green Arrow because he's my favorite. This one's wicked cool. Uh, if you like Mortal Kombat, it's the same people who do that game. Uh, but they made it with DC characters, and it's fun, it's a lot, of, it, it's it's just great, it's a good time. There's also a comic that goes along with it, so if you're into comics, go check it out in the iTunes store. Uh, you can download it there, uh, or from DC's website. But, again, Mortal Kombat meets DC. It's way better than Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe, because that thing was a piece of shit. But this game is awesome.
Okay, so here's the thing about Spider-Man games. There's a lot of them, and some of them suck. But some of them are really good. Like Spider-Man 2 through 3, awesome. Spider-Man Shadow Dimensions, this one, awesome. Ultimate Spider-Man, awesome. Uh, Edge of Time, uh, Shadow Dimensions, awesome. But I gotta say my favorite are these free range ones in New York City where you just swing around and you kick the shit out of people because it really makes you feel like Spider-Man. I mean, look at that. Look at that. That's that's so cool. And then with this, I can swap between the black suit and the red suit. Look at it. Oh, that's sexy. Ooh, that's sexy. It's just, it's a fun game. And it really makes you feel like Spider-Man. And honestly, from someone who wanted to be Spider-Man, uh, let's, okay, let's be honest, who wants to be Spider-Man, this really makes me feel like Spider-Man. So, awesome game. Good job, guys. Okay, so this might not be your typical kind of superhero in tights, crazy costumes game, but think of it like this. All right, you're given these powers. You're given a choice. Do you protect this city? Do you destroy this city? Do you help its people or do you help yourself? Now ask yourself one question. What the f does that sound like? It's a superhero game. And I think this gets it right. This gives you the freedom to choose. It gives you the freedom to play how you want to play. Do you want to be the hero or do you want to be the villain? So good job, Sucker Punch. You guys knocked this game out of the park. I like it better than the first two Infamouses, and I hope there's another one because it's going to be f***ing awesome if there is. Best superhero game I think that's out there. Get it. Infamous Second Son. Turn yourself in, Congratulations, you've made it to the end of the video. If you have, thank you. I just hit myself in the face. God, <laughs> mm, this stuff is really good. Uh, so for those of you who make it from start to finish on these videos, um, really you have no idea how much I appreciate it. So if you have made it to the end, I want to involve you. I want you to help me help you with what you would like to see. I should be like a rapper. Where's my posse? Yeah. Where's my unregistered weapon? So, <laughs> really, I want you to do my job. Uh, I want you to help me pick what you want to see next. I want you to tell me what you want. If you would like to see my top favorite RPGs, go ahead and click right here. I'll get somebody to come in, you click them. Boom, right there. If you'd rather watch my top five favorite first person shooters, boom, click this guy, gal, whatever, there's nobody here, really, but there will be. Thanks a lot, guys, for sticking around. Uh, I appreciate it, and hopefully I'll see you next time. I bow to you. <laughs> My ninja? Huzzah! Linguisa!